Hey friends, welcome back to Property Ask Echo channel. Today, we are diving into how you can maximize your earnings through rental properties in South Africa. This isn't just a theoretical discussion. We are talking practical, actionable tips backed by real data and expert insights. Whether you are an experienced investor or just starting, this video will provide you with the knowledge to make informed decisions and increase your rental income. Passive income is the dream money that comes in with minimal ongoing efforts. The context of rental properties, it means earning regular rental payment without having to actively manage your property daily. In South Africa, the rental market has been growing steadily. According to the latest data from PayProp, rental growth has shown a positive trend in recent years, making now an opportune time to invest. South Africa offers a diverse and dynamic property market. Cities like Johannesburg, Cape Town, Pretoria, and Durban have unique opportunities and challenges. For example, Johannesburg property market is known for its high rental yields, while Cape Town attracts a steady stream of tourists and expatriates looking for short-term rentals. This diversity allows investors to tailor their strategies to different market segments. Step one, choosing the right property. When it comes to rental property, location can make or break your investments. Areas with high demand, such as those near universities, business districts, or tourist attractions tend to have lower vacancy rate and high rental prices. According to Lifestone Property, suburbs in Johannesburg and Cape Town show the highest rental yields. Now that we've established the importance of location, let's talk about the types of properties that attract different tenants. Different types of properties attract different tenants. For instance, apartments in city centers are popular with young professionals while houses in suburbs are preferred by families. Consider your target tenant when selecting a property. Choosing the right property is only the first step. Financing your investment is equally crucial. That brings us to step two, financing your investment. One of the most common ways to finance a rental property is through a mortgage. South Africa banks offer various mortgage options tailored for property investors. Ensure you compare interest rates and terms to find the best deals. Websites like My Bond Codes provide comparative mortgage rates from various banks. South Africa government offer incentives for property investors such as tax deductions on mortgage interest and maintenance costs. The South Africa Revenue Services provides detailed guidelines on how these deductions work. With your property financed, the next step is maximizing your rental income. To maximize your rental income, set a competitive but realistic rental price. Research similar properties in your area using platforms like private property and Property24 to see what tenants are willing to pay. Well-maintained properties not only attract and retain tenants, but also allow you to charge higher rents. Regularly inspect your properties and address any issues promptly. Offering finished apartments or additional amenities like Wi-Fi and security can justify higher rental and appeal to broader tenants. According to my expert insight, investors should focus on understanding their target market and providing value. Properties that are well maintained, secure, and located in desired areas tend to have higher occupancy rates and rental prices. Let's look at a practical example. John, an investor from Johannesburg, purchased 
an apartment near the University of Johannesburg. By targeting students, he ensured a steady stream of tenants. He also offered a fully furnished option which allowed him to charge a premium. John's property now enjoys a 95% occupancy rate, generating a healthy passive income. Of course, every investment comes with its challenges. Step 4 dealing with challenges. Managing tenants can be challenging. Consider hiring a property management company if you have multiple properties or lack the time to handle tenant issues yourself. Secondly, ensure you understand the legal aspect of renting property in South Africa. Websites like TPN Credit Bureau offer resources and services to help landlords manage leases and tenant screening. While dealing with tenant management can be challenging, understanding the right strategies can significantly ease the process. If you are interested in learning more about a different but related aspect of property investment, I have another video on South Africa house flipping strategies for success that offers great insight. I will link it here. For you as well. To keep our community engaged, I'd love to hear your experiences with rental properties. Let's start with a poll. What do you think is the most common rental challenge? Please click on the link in the comment section to select your answer and feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. Maximizing passive income with South African rentals involves choosing the right property securing favorable financing, and maintaining your investment to attract high-paying tenants. By following these tips and leveraging expert advice, you can increase your rental income and achieve financial stability. Before we wrap up, I have another video on South Africa house flipping strategies for success that complement what we discussed today, linked here for you. Make sure to like, subscribe if you haven't already. See you in the next video.